Welcome to SBRforum.com. In this video, we're taking a look at teams that are built for the playoffs in the NHL. We're approaching the postseason very quickly, just a few more games left. So let's take a look at four teams that I believe are perfectly built for a nice playoff run. Let's start off in the Western Conference. Now, I've got one that may uh, not surprise you and one team that may surprise you. Let's start off with the, so the predictable one. It's the Chicago Blackhawks. Look, this is a team that's been favored to win the Stanley Cup throughout most of the year. Admittedly, at, throughout most of the year, they really haven't impressed. They haven't been that cutthroat, you know, impressive, dominant team. They've really given up a lot of units and coin to teams below 500. Uh, they have played well against teams above 500, but uh, been a disappointment for the most part. But still, this is a team that's going to be uh, third or fourth or, you know, wherever they are, uh, fourth, fifth, sixth in the Western Conference. They're going to be in there um, and uh, they're going to be a problem for somebody if they put it all together. Goaltending's been great. Uh, I think that's one thing that gets overrated with the Blackhawks, top five defensive team in the league. And... You know, that's impressive considering they're mostly known as an offensive juggernaut. Uh, not many people think of this team as somebody who's, uh, you know, so suffocating defensively. So if they can carry over that great defensive play and, you know, Patrick Kane can come back and the offense can start to click, this team is going to be a problem for a lot of those Western Conference contenders. They're very experienced, well coached, they've been there before. Um, I would not want to be facing the Blackhawks at any time in the Western Conference playoffs. Now, the other team is the Nashville Predators. I know it's a little bit surprising, but look, this has been one of the better defensive teams throughout the year. Uh, Pekka Arena, I'd say, is probably the best goaltender in the Western Conference, at least when he's on. He's been a little bit shaky since he came back from that injury, but he's uh, in the caliber as best in the NHL when he's on his game. And Nashville's offense has been playing pretty well for the most part this season. So when they're scoring well, when Rene is playing well, this could be a, a very challenging out in the playoffs. They're short on experience, but uh, they play great at home and they should have home ice advantage at least for one round, maybe multiple. And uh, that can sometimes make up for those jitterbugs uh, and those nerves. So we'll see with the Predators. But I think of, of the Western Conference, those are the two teams that are best built for the playoffs. In the Eastern Conference, I like the New York Rangers and the Montreal Canadiens. I mean, this is uh, pretty uh, textbook stuff, I guess. But you take a look at the Canadians, you know, obviously they went to the conference final last year, uh, played well with uh, Carey Price. He's been that good again this season, if not better, obviously something a little bit of late. But to me, the Canadians are a better version of who they were last year. And uh, I think we're going to see more of the same from them. I think that uh, Price right now, uh, and the way that they play defense around him, he's had a heart trophy type season. He can carry them at least to the conference finals, if not further. And the other team that will probably be joining them in the conference final is the New York Rangers again. I know it's uh, sort of a by the book, uh, very predictable prediction from me. Uh, these are the two teams that went to the conference final last year, but at least right now, that's what makes sense. The Rangers, they get a lot of love for being a quality defensive team. Of course, they added Keith Yandel to an already studded uh, blue line. Henrik Lundqvist has been fantastic throughout most of the season. He has been uh, kind of like Rene slumping a little bit since coming back from injury, but we know what he's capable of. Uh, this is a guy that's proven time and time again. We saw him carry the Rangers to the Stanley Cup Finals last season. But what's little known about this team is how good their offense is. Top five in goals per game. And I think that's impressive to me. When you got that defense, the blue line, the toughness, the grit, a team that does a lot of the little things really well, you add in that offense. This is a Rangers team that can go much further in the playoffs than people give them credit for. Uh, I know they've been hot over the last month or I guess two months now, but this team is no fluke. Uh, they've been playing very well and I think that they can definitely keep this going. So again, the four teams that I think are best built for the playoffs, Rangers, Canadians, Blackhawks, Predators. We'll see what happens once the puck drops on the second season. It's just around the corner. Uh, but uh, until then, those are my sort of, uh, my pardon me, my sort of preview on who I think may have uh, the right team, the right construction to go far in the playoffs. Thanks for watching this video right here on sbrforum.com. We'll catch up with you again soon.